I was going to film a summer to fall transition lookbook and then it occurred to me that we're not done with summer yet and I think we need to do some late summer outfits so that's what I am doing today. Okay this is a look that I know y'all have seen a bajillion times on the internet but I like it and I think it's a perfect late summer fit. It's been actually getting quite a bit warmer than it was at the beginning of summer so I'm definitely leaning into minimal clothing now. So I have got on these pair of thrifted little Adidas shorts. I've got on the Agatha chunky loafers from Reformation. Really love the loafer sock sport short combo. And then this is just a regular white tank top. This little bag is from a local maker. Um, her name's Juliana and she runs Zigo Studio. So cutie little canvas tote and then little Lou Goldie sunnies. But so easy, so comfy, perfect for days when the weather is very, very hot. Okay, another very simple outfit, definitely something we've all seen before. This is just a little vintage Levi's mini skirt. I've got some thrifted little mules on. Everlane t-shirt and my little Dio Studios bag. If I could change anything, I would have this gray be like a little bit of a lighter gray. I feel like it's like a tiny bit too dark for sort of the vibe I wanna go for, but very simple, comfy, good for hot weather. Okay, and then I also have these little DKNY thrifted sunnies. But yeah, I'm not going for anything too original here. We are wearing this little tank top again because I think it's just a summer staple. And then I have a little thrifted skirt, which I love. And I usually wear it very casually, but this time decided to pair with these gorgeous boots that I'm dying to actually wear out of my house sometime soon. And then just my cost bag that I use quite often, but super easy and simple. Feels good and comfy and all this stuff. Also got this gorgeous new shell ring from this girl named Kyra. Her company is called Weave Gold. How beautiful is that? Another very, very simple look, but something that I gravitate towards a lot. A white tee and a pair of vintage Levi's. This little tee is from Mad Happy. And then these are just a pair of vintage 501s. Little crochet bag with it. I really like the look of it on the side and for the crossbody now. I feel like this was me last year. And this is me this year. And then obviously my super burpees. My God, my armpits are so itchy. White tee and a pair of jeans. White tee and a pair of jeans. All right, another very simple outfit. I saw this image on Pinterest and wanted to create something like it because I don't have these exact pieces, obviously, but I remembered I had these little James Street knitted shorts, so I'm doing those. And then long sleeve gray top. Obviously this might be four day, but it's a little bit cooler outside perhaps. So long sleeve and then the Club C's from Reebok. I have had, I've been kind of stocking gazelles and like Onosuka tigers, but I just can't justify the price point right now. So these are kind of my alternative, like low profile sneaker that I think work with like work in the same way and give like the same sort of effect that those sneakers do. Um, and then thrifted bag, thrifted sunnies. I don't know, I really like this. This feels like very me. These um, shorts don't do a lot for my crotch area, so <laughs> definitely gonna figure that one out. <laughs> my ideas are plateauing. I'm just doing the same things over and over again, which I guess is great if you wanting to re-wear re things in your closet, but monochromatic, you know I love this. I feel like you can never go wrong. So thrifted shorts, little white tee. This is actually my new favorite t-shirt. It's from Young Maven. It's their laurel tee. It's like a mix of hemp and cotton. Just like threw a sweater over my shoulders because I really like the way this looks. And then little loafers and socks again because you can't go wrong. Maybe no bag with this look because I can't figure out which one I like with it. Just doing simple stuff. Fit simple things that we feel good in. That will get us through the next few months before we can get excited about fall clothes. Okay, I felt like I had to do a dress because I feel like it's a go-to option for summertime. And it's black because we're mourning the end of summer. <laughs> uh, this one is just a Gap one that I thrifted. I did my New Balance 530s with them. And then my favorite, most beloved cost bag. 
This little hat is from Aritzia. I think they still have it or a version of it. And then my thrifted sunnies, but very simple, very easy. I feel like these sorts of frock kind of dresses are relatively easy to find at the thrift store um, or like a curated vintage shop. Like I think this is like a style that lots of places look for to have their selection, I guess. So felt like it was an easy or, or simple option for many people that they might have something like this in their wardrobe. Last, but certainly not least, my favorite combo, light knit and bike shorts. Did you really think you were gonna get through a whole video without seeing this combo? Didn't think so. And the Super Brickies, of course. Little Digo Studios bag again. Nothing feels better than this, this outfit on my body. Ah, oh, I love it. So simple, it's cute, it feels good. What more could you want? Okay, that's it. It's all I could come up with. I don't know how I'm going to dress myself for the next month before it's fall, but if I think of anything else, I'll be back. But for now, that's it. Love you all so much. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.